Hi, this is Opera, member of SingSnap. I'm going to show you different ways to make banners and how to post them. And I'm going to kind of do this in a backwards way. Um, I am on photobucket.com, which is free, and most people on SingSnap use Photobucket. This is a banner I had already created for a different contest. And once you upload the banner, or the picture, whatever, on the right hand side, it says links to share this photo, email, direct, HTML image, and SingSnap uses the image code. So I'm going to get this image code by clicking on it and it copies it for me. And I'm going to go back to SingSnap. I'm going to right click and paste. Now you only need the image to image code. So you see the image right here? I don't need this URL equals any of that. I'm going to get rid of it. And this is going to show the, the actual picture I just had. But if I want everybody else be able to use it, I'm copying that because that's way uh, that's the way everybody else can see it. Now, what would happen is, I'm going to preview this, it would show both banners. You don't want that. You'd want one banner and then the code for the other one for the contestants. And this is how you do that. You open a bracket and put in the word code and close the bracket. And at the very end, open a bracket, backslash code, close the bracket. So if I preview this, this is what the contestants would see. So there's the banner. They would copy this and paste it on their profile page so that they could have it or on their recording page. That is how that part works. Now, how do I do this? Okay. Um, let me go to Blingy. Okay. I am a member of Blingy.com. Also, it's free. It's a free site and a lot of people use this. Also, make the pictures look better, I guess. I'm going to make a Blingy. And I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just going to pick any picture I have. I don't even know what I'm going to do. Look at me not thinking things through. What's on my desktop? Oh, hello. Let me just find a picture. Oh, ah. I'm sorry. I'm crazy. Oh, look, there's my face. I'm scrolling, scrolling. There's a king of them. Oh, da -da 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 -da. I'm talking to myself. Oh, look, there's a mountain top. I thought that's pretty. Okay, let me open the mountain top. Make a blingy. I'm so totally talking to myself and you because you're listening. Processing the image. I wish I could show my whole screen, whole screen at one time, but it gets blurry for some reason when it's when somebody would watch it. All right, image is ready. And I clicked on it. There we go. And it says to add some bling. And I'm not going to go crazy right now. Which is fun. This is so addictive. If you put pictures in and just start making stuff. Um, it gives you... Over here... The mouse movement is slow. How to add... Um, graphics and stuff. So on the left, it's going to show you what graphic is up. On the right, it shows you what they call the stamps. And there's so many different stamps you could use. You can just scroll through all those. Since I'm already on the hearts, I'll just use it. So I can stamp. I just left click. And little hearts show up. I can take the hand and move them around wherever I want them. If I happen to want those. If I don't want it, I can delete it. You can use the fill the area. So if I push this here, it's going to fill up anything that's that color so you can see that it's got all those hearts in what would be the background. Um, I could take this little guy here. Oh, I'll stamp him in and then I'll get out of here. I'm a little guy dancing. Oh, isn't he cute? Okay. I'm not going to use this for anything, but for right now I'll save it. Because there are a ton, 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 ton of different things. Okay, so I'm going to save it. 
and it's processing the image. Dun dun dun! dun. Hurry up! Image is ready. And it had a description. No, I'm not. I don't care. I'm going to keep it private because who needs to see that? Okay, I'll save it. And I'm only saving it because I want to show you something. Okay. Uh, what? Not bad. Oh, fill out the description. There. <laughs> okay, private. Okay. Save. Uh, da -dum -da -dum. Okay, so here's our little guy. I'm going to click on it. And it gives you different sizes you could use. And I'm going to get the code. Again, if I wanted to put this on a page. Okay, this is a little weird looking. You have to actually go down to Forums 1. It has a code down here, but that's not what Sing Snap needs. You have to like click Forums 1, and it changes the code. The code is huge. You only need the image to this backslash image code. You don't need all the extra stuff. Ah, what did I do that for? So I'm just going to copy that much right there. Right click copy. I'm going to go back to my right click paste and preview it. So there it is. And again, like the other one, you would right click paste and then do bracket the word code, close the bracket, bracket backslash code, close the bracket, and I'll, that's what people would see. So I didn't even have to use photo bucket. I just had a picture and you can add the things on there. So super simple. Hope that was easy for you. All right. Bye.